Okay, I don't usually do this, but I'm going to use today's quick tip to give you early insights into some upcoming functionality. To show you what to expect, let's quickly switch to offline mode, and when I do, you might not notice much. Which is amazing. No longer will offline mode completely destroy all the time and effort I've put into structuring my hub with projects, folders, naming, nomenclature, and sorting. Now when in offline mode, the most of the changes will be the visibility of the designs and documents. As it turns out, none of these are available to use, denoted by the color, and made more evident by the fact that they won't open when double-clicked. So we'll reconnect, and when the visibility changes back, we'll be able to open and access these files again. Looking at the details behind this valve, you can see there's a drawing that references it, and a referenced file, the plug subassembly. Remember this. Opening the file just once is enough to store it in the local cache, so if I find myself back in offline mode, I'll still be able to access it. Now some of these files are in the local cache, and some files are not. And even though I didn't open the plug independently, the reference in the main valve assembly was enough to ensure it was brought local. The same, however, does not apply to the drawing that references the valve assembly. It was not opened independently, and is not loaded into cache automatically. Anyway, I hope you're as excited as I am to use this new offline mode. It should be coming very, very soon. To learn about other offline mode developments, check out the blog linked in the description. More's coming. Cheers.